here I have LG G7 and let me show you how to bypass Google verification on the following device. So basically let me show you how to unlock FRP. As you can see at some point of initializing setup process the following screen may pops up and let me show you how to bypass this step for example in case that you forgot your Google credentials. At the very beginning let's use the following tutorial from hardreset.info and here you need to download a couple of things. First of all the LG drivers. Here we've got the list of drivers of course let's choose the LG one. Here you've got the LG drivers tab download. Alright, then let's download the LG Bridge. We've got the LG Bridge prepared for you. Choose this download button right here. And the third thing is the backup. We prepared the backup from LG G7. You need to use this backup because here you've got the quick shortcut maker installed. So that's what we need. We need to use this application. Afterwards, of course, let's uh, let's quickly install th those things, so the LG bridge and the LG drivers. Of course, let's also unpack the LG backup. Alright, so now you can go to your device. Here, let's go back by using the back key to the first screen. So, to the welcome panel, here let's choose accessibility, tab settings, choose vision, and let's enable the talkback. Tap turn on. Alright, now let's use L on the screen. Let's just write L letter on the screen. Let me do it again. That's what we need, the global context menu. So let's here choose the talkback settings. I think that's it's here. Let's double tap to confirm it. And this is the talkback settings. Alright, let me now disable the talkback. So let's use volume down and volume up together. Let me show you. Keep holding both keys. Choose use, let's double tap to confirm it. Let's use volume down and volume up one more time. Talkback is off, that's what we need. Let's scroll down. Here, let's find and select help and feedback. Choose get started with voice access. All right, let's play this video. So here, let's play it. Let's choose this share key. Choose more key right here. Let's minimize this video. Use the account icon in that corner. Select settings. Tap about. Choose Google privacy policy. Tap accept and continue. Choose no thanks. And now you can use the uh, Google searcher, that's what we need. Here you have to uh, find, search something with the phone number, so some restaurant, something like that. In my case, let me just, for example, uh, enter the KFC. So let's tap go. As you can see, KFC has the phone number that you can use from the Google searcher. Let's use the call icon right here. And now you can use the phone's dialer. So that's what we need. We need to activate the phone's dialer. Now let's open the hidden mode. So the service menu of the LG. So let's enter the following code. Asterisk hash 54 63 68 hash asterisk. And now you need to use your model number. In my case it's 710, but let's make sure which is your model number. So let's use 710 and hash. So the hidden mode pops up. Now let's open the field test. Choose LTE data test. Choose tethering mode and let's tap on Android again. Just to be sure you can do it even one more time. All right. So that's what we need. Now you need to go and open your LG bridge. So let me do it. This is my LG bridge. Now let's connect your device to your PC by using, of course, the USB-C cable. Here I have such a cable. Let me connect my device. All right, the LG is connected. Now on your PC, let's choose restore right here. Uh, 
as you can see something is wrong the device is not connected in my case but let me unplug and plug it again now the device is connecting choose restore so let's choose browse from the browser of course you need to find uh, your folder with backup so under in my case in downloads let's choose lg backup let's all tab ok to this uh, folder right here and let's wait until the restoring will be done All right, now let's unclick everything. Let's unselect all of them and in downloads apps, let's choose more key and select quick shortcut maker. That's what we need. Only we need to restore the quick shortcut maker. Let's tap start, tab OK and wait a few seconds. Alright, download apps is completed, the device is restarting, here on LG Bridge you can tap OK, you can minimalize it, you can also unplug your device, let me do it, the LG G7 is booting into the welcome panel, so let's wait a few seconds. Alright, the welcome panel is right here, that's what we need. Let's choose accessibility one more time, choose vision. Let's enable the talkback again, tap turn on. Let's write L on the screen one more time. Choose talkback settings. Use volume down and volume up. Talkback is disabled, scroll down, choose help and feedback, play this video, choose the share key, choose more key, let's close the video and let's use the accounts icon, tab settings, choose about, select Google, Google privacy policy and now let's enter something with address. So it could be also the KFC, so the KFC has the address tap KFC, that's what we need. And now you need to find the directions. So let me, here I have the directions icon, let's just tap the directions. Let's skip it. Here, let me tap OK. And let's choose here Start. Tap Got It. So, that's what we need. And now let's tap the microphone button. Let's find the microphone button right here. And let's use the open Google search command. Open Google search. Let me do it again. Open Google search. That's what we need, the Google search. So let me close 
the directions even or I can leave it all right and here let's enter the quick shortcut maker as you can see the quick shortcut maker pops up let's open it I'm not sure that I can oh I can I can close it so that's what I need and now let me use the setup wizard So let me enter setup wizard. All right, here I have setup wizard. And from the following setup wizard options, you need to use the following one with, with setup home exceed. I think this is the one. Here at the end, you need to have setup home exceed. Let's tap it, choose try. All right, let's tap OK here. Let me switch the English. Choose let's go. Now your phone is performing a hard reset. Let's just wait a few seconds. All right, the welcome panel pops up again. Let me switch into the English and let me try to activate the device without the Google account. Tap next. Let me skip internet. So it's a good sign that we can skip the Wi-Fi connection. Tap next a couple of times. Sorry, let me also skip the fingerprint. Tap next. Skip anyway. More and agree. Choose here some legal stuff and let's agree to them. Tap done. Tap later and that's what we need. Now we can use our device. So you just activate your device without the Google account. But to be sure that everything was erased successfully, let's perform the hard reset by using settings. Choose general. Select restart and reset. Tap factory data reset and choose reset phone. Right here. Tap delete all. Tap reset. And the device is performing the hard reset with the from the home screen from the LG settings so let's wait until this operation will be done The device is running the Android system. Let's wait a few seconds. All right, the welcome panel pops up. Now let's go quickly through the initializing setup process again. Let me switch into the English. Tap next a few times and let's bypass all of these configurations. Tap next, next. Choose no thanks, next. Skip anyway. Choose more and agree. The device is adding some finishing touches. All right, let's accept the legal stuff. Let me choose agree right here and here. Tap done. And that's it. As you can see, the home screen pops up. So it means that you just bypass Google verification. So everything went well. You just unlock the factory risk protection. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe our channel. Leave thumbs up under the video.